Cirque is absolutely brutal, requires insane levels of strength, tons of details. I had no idea how to get into it. We could not figure it out. It was a challenge for me. I love performing. It was something I got better at and I felt pretty confident in it. What do you feel like was the most challenging aspect? I would say the hardest aspect for me was one particular move I had. It's wrapped around my back. For me, that's pain tolerance and balance, which are two things I'm not super great at. It's easy to get frustrated not paying attention to what's necessary or most important. Get out of your own way and just be present. Just really working on the coordination for that move and then learning how to breathe was a challenge for me, but it was something I got better at and I felt pretty confident in it. This is a tough one. Pay attention. Tons of details. Learning to shift gears and get back on track mentally is vital for yourself and those around you. It's really awful to feel like you can't show who you really are because if you're faking all the time, then it all starts to become your new reality and you start to lose who you really are. Like for a while, I was trying to figure out who I wanted to be and if that was achievable for me. And I just didn't really have a lot of goals because at the time, my only goal was to impress other people. Once I started letting people in and they could see what I was dealing with, then it's easier for them to help you. They can encourage you or they can help you even get rid of things that are holding you back. How do you feel like you overcame that challenge? It was adding friends who really were gonna push me to tell them how I was doing. There are still times, I mean, I still deal with trusting people and I still struggle with insecurities and everything still, but it's not controlling me. I feel like I can open up to people more so I don't have to carry things on my own. Find something that you do feel good about, find something that you can control, and work off of it from there. Sometimes it's not the strength or the skill, it's the relationship, the attention to each other. Students must learn to listen and implement regardless of feelings, paying attention to even the most incidental. And coaches must give what's necessary, even when it might not be the most warm and fuzzy. What do you feel like you learned the most or you got stronger with? There were a lot of moves in there that I really enjoyed. I had no idea how to get into it. We could not figure it out. The solution is actually super simple. I just had to look at it a different way. But then also overall endurance was definitely improved. I was kind of given a list of moves and she said, pick the ones you like. So I really enjoyed most of the moves I got to do. For details, subscribe, but it's also totally free to opt in and connect with me and my team. Get more info, free videos, student success stories, email trainings, and even information about events, competitions for cash prizes, but more importantly, really take your training to the next level without struggling and getting stuck. 
If you want, schedule a complimentary coaching call with our team of doctorate physical therapists. This will open the door to getting into training for real. And if you do train this way, I'm daily blown away by what our students achieve. See you in the next video and in training soon.